Yo, what's up, DC? Xpernagon here, and today I am bringing you another style creation video. And today we have made Great Ape Vegeta. Oh my God, look how clean that looks. Oh my God, who is this person just blocking my view? Yes, sir, our Great Ape Vegeta. And without further ado, let's hop right into it. So first thing I'm going to show you is the materials you need if you want it to look like this. So first material we are using is the Orange Hex Neon Chroma 2, Caregiver's Neon Chroma 2, and Caregiver's Neon Chroma 1. I'm going to show you my color scheme. The skin is really the most important part because that's what makes the blue color. And that's pretty much it. Now, time to go over to the style pieces. So, we are using the werewolf headpiece. Okay, and this is going to be the orange hex neon chroma. Just going to make it that color. We're not using the face for our shoulders. We are using the for you, shoulders, and gonna make that caregiver two. Yeah, caregiver two. I'm gonna make that color yellow. For the back piece, we're using the reverse flash, I believe. Yes, reverse speed force. This gives you the red lightning on your back. Uh, you don't have to use this one. Uh, you can use enhanced. Where are you? Enhanced speed force. And you can get the yellow effect, but it's really up to you. It doesn't matter. It works either way. Because we aren't using this color, I believe. Are we? Yeah, we, we are not using this color at all. This is a free color that you can use, so if you really want to, you can switch this yellow color you know, to over here. And you can change this color to whatever the fuck you want your sparks to be. You can change it to purple or whatever. Okay, so back piece, reverse speed force, chest piece we are using, uh, I forgot the name of this chest piece, where are you? The Mysterian Battle Suit. Okay, and it's going to be Caregiver 1. Yeah, this is Caregiver 1. I'm going to make that yellow. And for the hands, we're using Dr. Fate. I'm going to make that Caregiver 1. Yep. There is no waist piece. A lot. There is a waist piece. I was just looking at my waist. Okay, for the waist piece, you want a demonic tail. And you're going to make that orange hex neon. For the legs, like I said, we have no legs. The blue color is from the glowing skin. For the feet, we are using, uh, what is this, a stalwart? Stalwart defender? Yep. And this is caregiver one. For the aura, this is your character. You can do whatever aura you like. It does not matter. But since it's Great Ape Vegeta, I'm definitely going to use a purple aura. Because you know. Yeah, no, that's the only way to go. Where the fuck are my purple auras? But yeah, you can put whatever or you like. Accessory, we are using the Speed Force Conduct. That's our accessory to get those sparks. For some reason, the sparks don't show on the boots as good. Maybe it's just monstering, I don't fucking know. But, we're using that. Emblem, there's no emblem hair, there's no hair, and skin. We are using the glowing skin. This is what's going to give you the blue color. The glowing skin, alright? So make sure you pick that. And that's it. That is the entire video on how to make Great Ape Vegeta. If 
you like the video give it a thumbs up if you haven't already subscribe i will be coming out with more content for dc and i will be coming out with more loadouts because now i am full precision i am full precision of my boo loadout so my bad but yeah i'm full precision now and i'm gonna be experimenting with a lot of powers a lot of powers Thanks for watching and...